Hi everyone, this is the Math 10C Polynomials Review and this is Multiple Choice Question 21. It says, which of the following represents the area of a circle, I'll move this over a little, with a diameter of 4x minus 6? Okay, well now what we have to do to answer this here is we have to remember that the area of a circle, okay, the area of a circle is going to be pi r squared, okay, and that r is the radius. And so now what we got to do here is we got to get the radius. Now this is the diameter here, this 4x minus 6, so how do I get the the radius out of that, well, the radius is half the diameter. So I need half of this. So half of 4, okay, is going to be 2. Half of 6, and our negative 6, is, as, you, as you might see it there, will be negative 3. Good. So there's our radius here. So what we got to do here is make this pi times 2x squared, sorry, 2x minus 3, all squared. Now, there's a very predictable trap here that we don't want you falling into. 2x minus 3 squared is not 4x squared plus 9. Okay? You don't just square the different parts of a binomial. If this was multiplied together, if it was 2x times 3, yes, you could. But now here you can't. The best way to interpret this is to think of this as pi times 2x minus 3 times 2x minus 3. Now, the pi is going to stay out front. We're not going to multiply that through. We'll just leave it out there. But 2x times 2x is in fact 4x squared, that is correct. But then we're left with 2x times negative 3, so negative 6x, negative 3 times 2x, which is negative, sorry, I don't know why I did that, negative 6x again, and then negative 3 times negative 3 is in fact positive 9, but there is this middle term here, negative 6 and negative 6 will give us a negative 12x. Okay, so this should be 4 times, sorry, pi times 4x squared, minus 12x plus 9, and, and hopefully you can see it's right there. The answer has to be D.